Hello everybody. <laughs> Hello everybody. Welcome to Amazon's game number five versus Bert's. Oh no, the pressure's on. The pressure's on. Um, is, is he got a? He hasn't even got the stadium. Maybe he just got banger after his first game. Why is it eight ninety? Don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> thanks thanks Rick <laughs> um, hello J5 well done well done um, <laughs> hello Flicky Flack VIP Flicky Flack no it's not VIP Flicky Flack sorry I lied Steve it's Jimmy it's Jimmy Flicky Flack only Jimmy Fantastic here thank you very much <laughs> um <laughs> <laughs> Very good, J5. Hello to Lurio. There's no ban fault force for gym points because there's been bugs with the new shadow banning thing. So there is no more frivolous banning for fun of fault force. So there you go. <laughs> oh, it's a good meme. It's a good meme, isn't it? Already instant, instant good memes coming from Rick being in chat. But uh, you're the boy now, aren't you, Rick Reckless? Number one, number one Blood Bowl streamer all time. I think it would definitely be Kane, right? Kane's Kane's much bigger. And, uh, you know, they both fake fight for a living. But Undertaker's done it more and got injured more. Undertaker's knees are fucked, aren't they? I think if they had a fight, it, Kane would definitely win. Even though, even though... Mark Calloway kids himself that he would have done UFC and stuff. I'm pretty sure the guy who was like less fucked from uh, from wrestling and knees are less destroyed and everything would uh, would win. Undertaker's like 85. Oh, Pedroy, you motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you bastard! Hello, kicks. <laughs> <Hello, Kicks. laughs> <Hello, Kicks. laughs> Undertaker's 85 years old. I'll just not say... Rick, do you want to come into Discord and you can just you can just do everything and I'll just sit here? <laughs> is that is that better? <laughs> That'll probably please more people. God, I'm so... My hair's so thin. When did that happen? It's got more and more thin. <laughs> you can just do the stream and I'll just fucking sit here like a cunt. In fact, we can get you on the other screen. You can get, you can get an app that makes you look... Um, you can make an app that makes you look old, right? And you can sit, we can get you on Facecam on the other side. <laughs> oh dear me. I, I, apparently he superseded me on both fronts, J5, so. <laughs> Circling the drain, I am T Swiss, yeah. Yeah, wrestling. Oh. <sighs> no, yeah. I've got to beat the Bretts. Oh, I'm, I've gone, honestly, right, this is, I feel like I should take off face cam. I know it's, I'm feeling really, really weird. Really weird, like, really ill. Oh, man. Blood Bowl Jesus is, uh, I don't know, how do you identify blitzers? I, I, well, they lean more forward and they've got a wider arms. Wider arms is the biggest thing. Um, <laughs> thanks, Rick. Yeah, it's been a long time without face cam. But I think the best way is just to have all skills on and then you know. Um, I'm going to put it off just for a little bit. And uh, I'm going to go... I'm going to go and get a protein bar and eat that. And hopefully I'll feel a bit better.
Also, I've uh, also I've taken my top off because I'm too hot. So, while well, that's very exciting, um, it is against terms of uh, terms and conditions of <laughs> of YouTube's and and Twitch, isn't it? You can't you can't just uh, get you take your top off. Christ, I'm, I haven't gone full Sage because I'm not streaming. I'm not streaming myself topless. <laughs> Which I still can't believe was a thing that happened, but there you go. He did, yeah, because it was hot. <laughs> it was hot one day, so he just streamed topless. <laughs> As you do. <laughs> right, I'm, I'm really ill. I'm going to just not commentate. Or, uh, or have um, face cam on. For a little bit. So joking about Rick replacing me would probably be a good idea. <laughs> I'm really hot and uh, hot and horny. No. I'm just hot and ill. So, right, choose. Hopefully it's just for a few minutes while I recover. <laughs> All right, yeah, the desktop audio isn't working. Ah, so that's how you only heard it through my, um, through my thing. Hmm. Day, and so was my cock. Okay. Right, now we've got it. Okay. Oh shit, I forgot the wizard. Oh no! Oh no, he might just go for the attrition. Five players. Fuck, I should have been one or two back. Oh fuck! Right, sorry, I'm still boiling and everything. Right, I'm gonna have another protein bar. <laughs> and, uh, just not talk for a bit.
three words. Shut up, cunt. End the turn for fuck's sake! End the fucking turn, man! Good morning, Skura. I'm not really saying anything for a little bit as I'm just feeling weird. I have this thing where I just fucking feel really weird and blood pressure goes really low. It's just weird. I'm gonna find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within an inch of their Oh, oh no, he did it end the turn! I thought he hadn't done it! And then he just fucking randomly, randomly went for it. Hey, and it was shit. <laughs> you fucking shit stain. <laughs> fucking birds. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, anyway. Feeling better now. <laughs> he could do the blitz. And then I've already got the guard in there anyway. Defend. Brilliant skill, brilliant defensive skill. So good. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, he can go there. Hmm. Where does he go then? If I wanted, I don't think I do though, but I could. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> it was the wizard, Bert Whisperer, absolutely. These apple power apples come out here. Bloody hell, it's a bloody power apple. I can't believe it's a power apple. All or nothing, it's a new bloody team. It's not really a power apple, it's just a normal apple, isn't it? Isn't it? Fair enough, I'm not criticizing him. I don't know if he's watching, he just said, All or nothing, new team. But, uh,. The power up was a stupid bloody term anyway, and it's just playing properly. <laughs> oh, the wizard. <laughs> Rookie error, yes, he sucks. Um, Fumble Burt's or Cyanides? I don't know, on Fumble's the same now. Do you mean Secret League ones? I probably prefer these ones anyway. Victor Meldrew, <laughs> a flat cat. <laughs> I don't believe it. Wizard and Apple Gun, yeah, that's true. He's in a he's in a tough spot, isn't he? Yeah, mighty blows protected by guard. Yeah, I'm not I'm not a fan of any of the Secret League teams, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Really well, there's a few that I think aren't so bad. 
but I, I still prefer this to that one, honestly. Um, there you go. Anyway, kill. I just take wrestle when I've got enough block. When I think enough block is is you know, just depends. Just depends. I like things to be official. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm totally, I'm totally biased, you know, it's fair enough. I, did, I don't like Sage's Slanesh team, but then I don't really like any Slanesh team, so there you go. Fucking peasant straight in with the dub skulls. I'm putting everybody to hit a line or but... He can't hit the uh, mighty blow, he can't stop himself getting hit by the mighty blow next turn. Good. Well, I don't like jokes, and I'm funny of it. Fucking jokes. No, they're not. The birds aren't official. I don't like birds. I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't like birds either. I don't like these birds. And I don't like, um, I don't like either Burt's. I would like a Burt's that fit the, the fluff more. But I don't think the Secret League ones do. And obviously these ones don't. That's a bit disappointing, isn't it? Mm, I didn't really want her stuck on the fender, but I guess that's what's going to happen. <laughs> Now he's going to get to hit both um, Mighty Blow guys if he wants. Unless I somewhat protect both of them. Which I guess I can. Well done, Pedro. <laughs> Bird fluffer. Um, I don't know what TLC. At least these fit what Fluffy made for them, you know, of the of the knights being different to human blitzers. If you give them strength, then why are they their own team? Why aren't they just a human team? So, hello, Dean McCall. Um Give every peasant... No, I would make peasants 6337. Just the same as hobgoblins. Exactly, identical to hobgoblins. I don't know, Martin. I think he's like the sweeper. I think he probably read a guide about having a sweeper back or something and then has a sweeper back. But he's really far back, isn't he? Contributing nothing. Yeah, see, I, I don't like any of that shit. I, I, would, I, want the, I want the peasants to be 6337. They're humans, right? They're just the same. They're just the same as uh, as hobgoblins, aren't they? Obviously. So they should be the same. Crazy that they're not the same as hobgoblins. And then I didn't mind that, the, you know, the, the fucking fluff that eventually Plasmoid came up with. That, um, you know, the blitzers for the knights are flashier. And so they've got agility. I mean, that's, you know, that's something, isn't it? <laughs> God, sick as eggs. <laughs> it's terrible. What do you think, what do you think, uh, bloody... Oh, fuck off. What do you think, uh, fucking... Hobgoblins do all day. They don't just sit on their asses, do they? 
you know. Like, that's the thing. <laughs> yeah, hobgoblins are slaves. Hobgoblins are, for, you know, peasants are essentially slaves, right? Hobgoblin, you know, hobgoblins are slaves and peasants are essentially slaves, so why do they have st different stat lines? They're both basically humanoid slaves. Seems crazy to me that they've got different stats. Stupid. Oh, goblins are not made out of rocks and dirt. <laughs> yeah, but that's the same as help goblins. That's just the same. That's the point. That's ex identical to help goblins. Why are help goblins different? Doesn't make sense, does it? I mean, I don't know why you would argue that, and I would argue that you would win. Well, no, Skavens have Skaven slaves. As an actual thing, don't they? Oh god, Mighty Blow doing nothing to his armor 7. Just quietly. I'd like to get further forward, but then I can't keep the ball safe, can I? Oh, yes I can. Yeah, yeah, I can go over here. Okay, we'll then protect him a little bit. Yep. Got four rerolls, I could even try GFIs. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> See? See, Johnny Five, this is why. This is why I don't fucking use rerolls frivolously. This is why I don't want to fucking tick. You know, that's it. Why did I fucking. Stupid. One frivolous GFI because I got a bonus reroll. Instant fail. <laughs> yeah, Linos are clan rats. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah that's it. That's what I would say. The fact that you know the fact that storm vermin are the blitzers, then that would Im that would imply it was bad play. It was it was a completely frivolous GFI. I mean, I was uh, it would have been worth it making both, but making one was no good. But two would have been all right. To, you know, base him and then give the free hit if he stands up. So it was payoff to the double GFI. Um, the th idea is to swim. There's Jorzus is uh, giving some money away to whoever does the best with a team that hasn't won the chalice before. So um, that was a bit of a motivation in use choosing Amazons, but also they're easy and fun, aren't they? Uh, peasants are AG2, yeah. I don't think you should be. Yeah, exactly. I, I, and have Fen. For some reason, a peasant can fight off a Minotaur better than a Chaos Warrior. Um, and also, for some reason, they can't dodge or carry the ball as well as Hobgoblins, which are also essentially slaves. He finally has a roll of power! Outrageous! Glorious! Hello, the show. It is I. I have returned. Yes, he didn't power gain. Twice in one game. Thanks. <laughs> it's great to be back. Great to be back. <laughs> um, they learned how to take a beating. Yeah, it's so stupid. I really hate. I really hate the, the rationale and everything.
Let's leave Fault Force out of this, Jelly Up. <laughs> only, only joking. <laughs> only, only joking. <laughs> He's given us a little bit of room up here, hasn't he? And when I say a little bit, I mean absolutely acres of space. This one can go here and give the assist and base the uh, peasant as a boy, isn't it? Il au secours de ce joueur. Ça va faire mal. Il s'acharne sur ce pauvre joueur comme des alphrigues autour d'un sandwich. Ring the damn bell. <laughs> Why? Why can't I fucking hurt peasants? Honestly. Oh, so annoying. So annoying. Allez, les gars, tous ensemble. Yes. Good. Bang on him. Oh. Yeah, but you know, this is like, why are, why are they different to why? <laughs> <laughs> and none of it makes sense. If peasants are just conscripted outside, how how can they defend against a rampaging minotaur better than a fully trained blood ball player? Doesn't make any sense, does it? <laughs> also, what about what about bloody Hobgoblins, what kind of diet do hobgoblins have? What kind of training do hobgoblins have? It's just daft. Hobgoblins are just slaves. You can't make a humanoid slave that's got worse stats than him. I'm sorry, it just doesn't make different stats to him and better stats. But Fen's better than... Fen's better than fucking war dancers and everything. It's just stupid. Like, no one else starts with Fen. Fucking Griff Overwald, the greatest player of all time, has learned how to fend. It's fucking ridiculous. Disgusting. <laughs> yeah, carrying with a bull can be extremely good, yeah. Yeah, I have done. I have carried on a bull. I didn't like it. <laughs> Funny enough, I was like, never, ever, ever take show hands on a bull. Then I took show, show hands on a bull. But peasants have pure nutrition, but what what do hobgoblins have? <laughs> you know what I mean? Fluff wise, C Sabs, it has some use right. First of all, Fend has some use, so yes it's a useful skill. Second of all, fluff wise You know, it it's a skill, isn't it? It's a blood ball skill. Hobbles are a mythical creature. Well, you know, look, they've got the same stats as humans. They're human slaves. They're essentially human slaves. That's what they've always been, like, the same stat line as. And I'm sorry, but it's bollocks. It's bollocks. It's absolute bollocks. Shit. Uh, because Kislevs are... They are slaves. Oh, they always have been slaves. They always were slaves in the, uh, in the law. Maybe they've changed things now, because... But, you know. <laughs> Alright, where does he want to go? I don't know if I want to go anywhere. Punch him first. Punch him. Of 
God, I hate wrestle. Super annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, seven, okay. Uh, I kind of need a one, two, three, four, five. That's not good, is it? So, one, two, three, four, five, six. And double, and that's not, doesn't really work. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so we're gonna have to blitz with him. And you know, get a knockdown. It didn't fucking happen. Yeah, I'll do the block first, I guess. Hey, knock down a peasant. Get up there. That's the real answer, Panzova. It, 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 it's well, it's not just a bit of diversity. It's bloody plasmoid wanted to use the new skills. Oh, I can have wrestle and fend on the same team. Yay! That's what it was. That was a shit turn, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, gobble palooza's. Yeah, yeah, that's right, isn't it? <laughs> well, they were they were once Kilmatronics, yeah. They were when Living Room Book 6 came out. Well, Living Room Book 5. They were new. And then Plasmoid's little brain ticked over and thought, Ooh, I'll use the new skills. Like when everybody told Galak Piling On was overpowered. Everyone with a brain told Galak um, Piling On was overpowered. And Galak was like, No, you can use Wrestle and Fend. You just need to learn the new skills. Maybe Pedro, maybe. I just I think Games Work now that Games Workshop brought back in control, they're not gonna give a fuck about anything, so they'll make up millions of wacky new rules and won't care about any of them. Because Gallic's stupid. Sophist. <laughs> Sorry, that's unfair, isn't it? Gallac isn't the best uh the best Blood Bowl player ever. <laughs> Galak Starscraper, isn't he? He's named after a referee in the fluff. Yeah, Jugs came out with Wrestle and Fend and piling on. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, Monstrous Mouth and Critney. Good, good point. Yeah, so they'll probably end up adding loads of crazy skills like that. Yeah. I can't believe how I've only removed two players. I guess he did Apple one, so I removed three. And he's removed two. That's fucking crazy. I hit so many fucking peasants with Mighty Blow and just done nothing. Yeah, Timber, yeah. Yeah, Disposable. Yeah, he, he got rid of Aging, which was the best change. You know. Got to give him credit for getting rid of aging. Anyone who got rid of aging can't be all bad. Ah, oh, yes, yeah, swoop. Yeah. Yeah, so loads of new skills already. So, yeah, I guess they will keep adding loads of skills. Yeah. yeah good point. God, the fucking end of turn Randall foul. Doesn't make a removal. Outrageous. Right. Need to make a block here. Make a block there, which frees up him to do the blitz, which means he can stand up and block him. Then he can blitz him and move round there. 
So actually, maybe it's to stand him up. No. Yeah, stand him up first then. And do this block. Just in case it was a one in. One in um, lots. <laughs> right, he can block him. Let's push him. And then blitz that dude. One, two, three, four, five, six, so there. Can he go to here? So he wants to guess and guess out in front. Mm. Gonna be a couple of GFIs here, isn't there? No, just one. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I don't even need a GFI. One, two, three, four, five. I miscounted. Well done, Jim. <laughs> Cheeky miscount there. Glorious. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cheeky one D. Don't mind if I do. Good. good. Yeah, soup is good, improves them quite a lot, yeah. None for level ups, yeah, that's it, yeah. Yeah. He'll marry ass. <laughs> Yeah, they've changed skills, but they haven't made new ones, yeah. Forces of follow-up, yeah, like taunt or something. I don't know if that's worth it. To be honest, I don't think anyone would take it, that's the thing. At least Fen protects you from piling on and stops Frenzy. And, like, frees up players. I think the, the, the taunt one like that, m multiple people have said it. I don't think anybody would ever take it, really. <laughs> <laughs> but no panning. Well, there is panning on now. Um, Jelly only changed it. They changed it. Um, they changed. They changed panning on Jelly so that it, panning on by default uses a reroll, and the optional roll is to have Living Room Book Five panning on. Yep. Yeah, but then it would have to be a strength skill, and if it was a strength skill... I guess it could be a strength skill, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, it could be a strength skill. Yeah. Yeah, strength skill being... Make it a strength skill. I guess you could do that. I guess you could make it a strength skill. That kind of makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, flicky flick. <laughs> yeah, and then it would basically be just for big guys, wouldn't it? Yeah, that would, that would make sense. But then you might as well take Stand Firm, right? Like, Stand Firm does essentially the same thing, but is more useful. Like, you know? So, really, it's just too narrow, isn't it? Because why, why wouldn't you choose Stand Firm? Yeah, we can. I don't know how many of those people count. <laughs> but the thing is, it's... Like, that's the thing. Who would, who would you have testing the rules? Like, what are the rules for? The rules are there to sell miniatures. That's all they're for. Right? So, who's to say that making it a balanced, fun game to play, like, is the goal, right? It's... The goal should be selling miniatures. So if the rules are stupid and and like that, maybe that's better. If the rules are, 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 are shit and wrong, because then more people will have fun. Good bit of fun. Yeah, exactly, Wolfbark. Yeah, yeah. Right, I've got a dodge, haven't I? There's no getting away from it. 
He's got this screen and a tag. One, two, three, yeah. Oh no, I could pile both of these. And then go one, two, three, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, no. No, there's nothing to do except except blitz and uh Blitz and dodge. Another hit against Armour 7 with Mighty Blow, another non AV break. <laughs> what a. <laughs> the least it's crazy how much I've fucking hit him with Mighty Blow and just done nothing. Well, okay, not nothing, but no chances. He's got two chances of the KOs, so. It's not technically nothing yet. But it's close to nothing. So I'm a bit like Space Cadet now, aren't I? I badly hurt him, but I didn't kill him. It doesn't. It doesn't even matter. <laughs> but um. Really, for the like, it's a crazy amount of blocks on armor seven. Defenseless armor seven with mighty blow. I would have liked to have, I'd like to have leveled her up this game. To tell you the truth, quite a farker. Right. Provisional new rules. I don't think there are provisional new rules, Chilio. They just change, you know, like they, they change things. That <laughs> the rules for Blood Bowl are in a million places now. That's a, that's a bad thing about, about Blood Bowl nowadays is the rules are in like a million places. So you've got to have all different things everywhere. <laughs> Get lift hooked, come back. Yeah, exactly, exactly to swim. That's the thing. It's like C'est un super match jusque là. Even Le rythme s'est un peu ralenti, mais ça va reprendre de plus belle d'une seconde à l'autre. <laughs> yep, TLC, yeah. Yeah, Rick, I would have loved a cast. I would have loved a cast. Sneaky git, yeah, guard for fouls. I think that's shit. Honestly, I still don't think anybody would take it. Maybe people would take it more of it on goblins and stuff. But I really don't think it's going to make a big difference. I think what would be nice would be when you get, when you get sent off, if you've got sneaky git, you'd get sent to the KO box rather than the Kaz box. So you come back in a 4+. plus. I quite like that. quite like that idea, to tell you the truth. Also, you could just give that special rule. Then, then you could just give that to... Uh, in secret weapons as well, right? And then they could get sent off and then sneak back on again. Which I think, um, yeah, exactly, yeah, Pedro. I think it'd be shit. You don't, you'd only really take it on goblins and stuff, and then they'd have to be in a tackle zone for it to work. And you don't want to be in a tackle zone and assist anyway. And it would just, I think it would be terrible. I think it's a genuinely terrible idea. The guard for files. I really hate that idea. But I really like when you get sent off if you've got sneaky gate on a floor plus you come back on like you know well like, you get sent to the KO box rather than the injury box if you get sent off. The only bad thing then is babes. That's that that's the bad thing that the bad thing then is babes, because obviously you don't want them sneaking back on a two plus because of babes. You could just say they're four plus. Yeah, sneaking back on the pitch exactly, yeah, sneaky gate, yeah. Um so you would have to. You'd have to. You, you know. You wouldn't actually. Well, you could send them the KO box, and then after a touchdown scored on a four plus, they return. It's not a KO roll, so it's not affected by babes. You can. You can make that. It's just. Not, it's not that much, is it, to do that? I quite like that. I like it. Yeah, it would make elves the best elves. That's the problem as well, isn't it? If you make sneaky get better, you make elves better as well. Yeah. Yeah. Be really good for goblins though, wouldn't it? Holy shit! Be really good for goblins getting your getting your chainsaw sent off, and then he sneaky gits comes back on. <laughs> Would be awesome. Thanks, Flicky Flack. 
Whoa, that's that's. I don't know if that's big brain jaws as I've just overpowered his fuck brain. <laughs> um. <laughs> so. <laughs> yeah, Pedro. Yeah. Um. No, I'm not really, Jerry. No, I don't think. I don't think I've ever. I've probably had it on like a fourteen-man dark elf team. You know, just because then you can foul claw pommers, can't you? Yeah, yeah that's no change if you don't trust them, that's fair enough. <laughs> Well, the idea is plants over it and, um, that the the teams always use some kind of loophole in the rules to get them on at the, for the pitch at the start of the game. That's why they always start. That's from the second dead flip. That the um, that they can always get them on the field. They have loads of rules lawyers, um, which was a nice little uh, shout out thing, wasn't it? And they have loads of rules lawyers that. Uh, that you know, find loopholes to get them on the pitch, and then once they're on, the, then it takes them till a touchdown for the refs to like, you know, get it sorted out. That's the idea. Yep, you could wolf bark, and I think they're more favouring the roulette side. Which who you know, no one, no one can say that's wrong. Like you literally can't say it's wrong. Because, um, <laughs> just because we wouldn't like it, can you, you know? Well, I say we, do you know what I mean? Like, pe some people wouldn't like it. Just because some people wouldn't like it, and other people, like, you could make, you could go, you could go make it like chess, couldn't you, and make it super competitive. You could make, keep it as it is now, where it's nearly competitive, but still massive, massively swingy with dice. Or you can make it even more so when you make it total crapshoot. You know, like, there's a whole range, isn't there? Uh, what I hear is whenever whenever anybody says, like, you know, say this is the... Say this is the... the Skill to look. And say Blood Bowl's here. Anyone who says, I'd like it about here, people are like, play chess then. <laughs> and it's like, you know, it doesn't have to be... There's there's a wide range where it can be, isn't there? And it doesn't, you know, let, let, let's say it's it's about midway at the moment. You know, it could be nudged either way, or it could be completely swung either way, couldn't it? There's, it could you could do anything with it. And I think a lot of people who play it a lot would like it a bit of the look toned down. You know, like make apples or make apples always work and stuff like that. You know, just some of the things that feel better, like like getting rid of aging when Gallic got rid of aging. You know. Get rid of piling on because piling on just isn't fun for anyone really, you know, and stuff like that. So I think, I think that yeah, no, Jolly, that's fucking ridiculous, isn't it? Glorious. <laughs> no, I won't give in <laughs> until I'm victorious, and I will defend. I will defend. Mighty Bush, twenty months, incredible. Who's this handsome bastard I see before me? <laughs> It's me. I'm back. Thank you very much for staying fantastic for 20 months. Five who will be with pregnancies. Oh yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, yeah, it's... I don't know, Rividius. I don't know. Maybe it is, but still, you could still do it, couldn't you? Like, for example, Blitz. You could change it a little bit by saying... Um, you know, you can move three players on a blitz. That's one way. That's one way you could change that to make it not quite as ridiculously brokenly swinging on you, right? So I don't think it is. I think it is kind of easy to change it, to move it across a little bit. Um, because just as, as we've experienced now, instantly. Fuck off, man! Will his armor never fucking break? Ah! Um, <laughs> you know, things like that. You can have pitch invasions be a bit different. You know, there's all sorts of things that you can you can change a little bit. 
There's all sorts of things you can change For a little fuck's bit. Fuck's sake, Tony! Stop being shit! Yeah, yeah, they've done. They've done. Yeah, they have given the the crap races a bit of a buff. Yeah, that's nice. Anyway, hello Gadenik. Hello, killed by propaganda. Hello, Tony plays poorly. Sorry that I kind of ignored you there, but I was mid rant. Yeah, new MVP is brilliant, isn't it? New MVP, brilliant. More fun. You know, every everybody, whether they were competitive. Like, if you want to call them fun havers who want it here, and competitive who want it, well, nearer here. Fun players want it near, nearer here, and competitive players want it nearer here, for sake of argument. Then, whether you're, whether you're uh, competitive or uh, fun, you still don't like your fucking dead player getting an MVP, or a star player getting an MVP, or a legend getting an MVP. So the stuff like that, are just it's just good for everybody, isn't it? Yes, I like that as well, Gilliam. Yes, for sure. You you want them to be underdogs, but then nobody wants to not be fu not fun. <laughs> VIP Tony plays poorly. Sorry, sorry, VIP Tony plays poorly. Hello. <laughs> Oh god, no, because things have to be set in stone Kilmatronics, really, because just the player base, isn't it? That's the thing. It should be cross platform if at all possible as well, just because of the player base. They've got to make it as consolidated as possible. Because you need that critical masses of uh of players. Don't you? And if you split the split the player base down into a million fucking things, it's just not gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking great on the Xbox. <laughs> yeah, exactly, KBP, yeah. Mm. Yeah, I thought about doing that, Gillian. I thought about using flings and stuff in local leagues. No, well, I just think there should be one Q. You know, I think that's the problem. I think you need less queues. And I think you should have cross platform as well. I think it needs cross platform. Um, so. Like, that was a separate point when I mentioned the cross platform. But I think it kind of has to be cross platform, if possible, to. Um, you know, hey, he finally, finally removed a shitlord. Outrageous. Fucking outrageous. Right, he was going to go here. So that he can then go there and chain this guy forward a square just in case it matters. Fucking tit end. Alright, let's go for a scatter or not. Stand here first. He could do the scatter. <laughs> I guess it is cool much mix, yeah. Got him. Oh, he catches anyway. Good. Glad I made that a 5 plus so we could roll a 6 anyway. <laughs> Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have scattered. 
But there was loads of good scatters for me, wasn't there, to pick it up and then have the ball. Like that was a one in four to go at one of his guys and then a five or a six to catch it. So it was a pretty low chance for him to get the ball, wasn't there? But, you know, one in 24. Yeah, fair enough. But then if he, but then that's the thing though, right, Jaleel? Then if he scatters it, then it can go well for him. There was a good chance of it going well for him if he was able to chain scatter it. So I wanted to scatter it so that I could get a pick up and get it in my hands, didn't I? Otherwise, if I left it on the floor, he could have scattered it. And then he, maybe he gets it and runs away. So that was that was my rationale, whether it's right or wrong. Yeah, and then he would have had that guy free to then run away and score, so who knows. Yeah, he was to scatter himself though, you didn't. Yeah, exactly, Jelly. Yeah, he says you were agreeing. Okay, fair enough. I thought you were saying. I thought you were saying it was bad to scatter, but yeah, that's the thing, he was going to scatter himself. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Blue Ball 3 won't have all the new stuff just because they're not going to have animations for like cr Krakens, Krakens going over the fucking field and shit like that, are they? You know, they're just not going to have all the mechanics because of the. And like the pit traps there, there's a, there's a pit trap, um. Oh, what's it called? Like trampoline trap in, in Fumble, and the reason it wasn't implemented, I don't know if it's implemented now, but it wasn't implemented for ages just because the animation was like they just thought, how the fuck do you animate it? So things like that probably, you know, there'll be things that won't be in just because of the animations. <laughs> yeah, that's fair, Jelly, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, exactly as well, yeah, with Buck. Like a lot, lots of things you couldn't really have cross-platform and then have some guy with a mouse destroy somebody with a with a with a controller whereas with blood ball um, they wouldn't get an advantage so it'd be fine wouldn't it <laughs> well yes Jaws is that is that is how Artemis's mind works yes <laughs> Unless it's me with a controller, yeah, that's true. That's true. I mean, to be fair, I've done that with a mouse as well, so. <laughs> well, no, I mean, it would be good to have it on consoles so that there'd be more players on PC. <laughs> if you had the cross platform, cross platform would be great because there's just not enough players on Xbox or PS4, is there? So it's like, it's just brutal to have. Like he's just, yeah. People, some people just don't have the PC in it. Do they? It kind of does, doesn't it? Yeah, especially like with the new ones coming out as well. They just aren't even good. <laughs> Not even as good as. Uh... <laughs> I made myself an extra block here, I didn't need to do this, did I? I could have changed it anyway. Oh god. Um, one, two, okay, so. He wants to go here. Let's do safe moves after using the reroll. That's a great idea. He can hit the ball. One, two, three, four, five. I don't even need to make that block first. I can just hit now. Okay, good. I can take the ball down as well, can't I, for the uh, wrestle? Don't need to. Alright. Could power him to there and then go on to now. Power him and then run through that way. Good job, did it with block. Fantastic, he can tie up those two. Right, how the fuck do we get the ball? Not easily. Try though, try a five plus with a re-roll. Worst possible, well it wasn't the worst possible scatter, but it wasn't a good scatter, was it? <laughs> I did movement seven on one turn to on Xbox, yeah. Yes, DLC, that's true, yeah. 
Yeah. Mobile cross platform, yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, doing so. exactly, yeah, Wolfpack. Like, you should always do the safe moves like those stand ups that were never ever going to be blitzes. It wasn't whether I wanted to kill something as well, it was to, free, it was to see if people were freed up. To see who was going to be able to tag the carrier and stuff, and whether I was going to have to dodge that guy out. This one was maybe he's going to have to dodge out to tag the carrier and stuff. Um, but, like, these two weren't ever going to blitz, so they should have stood first. But not this one. Because this one was going to maybe tag the carrier if I didn't get a knockdown there and stuff. No, that's true. That's true, Squirrel. Yeah. Fucking GTA's failed again. Do my head in. I uninstalled it to see if that would help, but it just fucked up again. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, oh, fuck off. Well, good job I did the safe move of getting fucking instantly badly hurt. Right. We've both got ten aside then. <laughs> oh dear. Mobile BB would be alright, wouldn't it? The problem is it just lasts so long, doesn't it? Don't you fucking dare. Don't you fucking dare. Good. Fail on the reroll. So you can farm at work. Ugh. Yeah, fumble on tablets, yeah, that'd be alright, wouldn't it? Is he gonna follow after the question? Get a pal here and it's brilliant, isn't it? He pals, then he's the assist for the 2D on the ball. Right, so he's not going to blitz. <laughs> Is he going to dodge out? No. Fucking both down, man. I'm so fucking pissed off with Blood Bowl. It's such a shit game, isn't it? <laughs> what a shit game. Fucking Blood Bowl. Who play it? Another fucking invincible peasant! Didn't even think I could break armor eight with Mighty Blow. Nah, I don't play on football. The eyes, my eyes, my eyes uh, hurt when I play football. Can't dodge with that armor ten. Yeah, fair enough, Verna. <laughs> That's fair enough. He's down to one re-roll, which is good, but then so am I, which is bad. I'm going to next season, Jillio. I'm going to next season. VIP Tony plays poorly has forced me 
Force my hand, and I will have. To, I'm gonna have to play my birds next season. And get, ruin my record with them, no doubt. Yep, super serious. God, I don't know when rerolls are really grim, isn't it? <laughs> I did not have fun with Brett. The good thing is, though, Gilliam, is that I, that I have to try with them. I have to try with Brett's. I think that's why I do better with them. I think that's why I do better with Brett's. Because I've actually got to sit there and think because they're so fucking shit. <laughs> they're so appalling that I have to not really pay attention to chat and uh, really have to focus on trying to play with them. Yeah. <laughs> I like that he nearly had a cage like he had a cage free to make and he's like fuck this I'm just going to blitz and not have a cage I like that <laughs> all about the births It's hilarious that he abandoned yeah. making a cage. It's really great. <laughs> KBP. Oh, he did the Rando 1DB. <laughs> With one reroll. <laughs> the KO stops instant dice on the ball. <laughs> Classic. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so mighty blow a punch. Oh, good. There's my dub skulls and last re roll down. Instant dub skulls. <sighs> Fuck me, man. This fucking game. Two dub skulls this drive, and a fucking double one when I tried to uh, both down when I hit when I hit the ball without block it was a both down, and then two double skulls as well. At least I'm not going to lose to Brett anyway. That's one good thing. Definitely not losing this game, but may well draw it due to zero damage. <laughs> no, the one Kaz, isn't there? One Kaz on a peasant. And multiple hits on the ball. Uh, Ducky's won twice. Won CCL like three times. I think he's only won it with Burtz once. Oh he, got, he won with Burtz and he got beaten by Burtz in the final. Burtz have won twice, but not both by Ducky. I'm pretty sure. And he lost to Burt in the final. He lost to Burt in the final. He had Orcs as well. So it was a basically unlosable game. His team was like a million times better than the than the uh, Bretts. And then somehow he, he just got diced to fucking buggery by the by the Bretts and lost. <laughs> it was a, it was a unreal. Day. At least he rolled the double skulls as well. So we're both out of rerolls. <laughs> um, yeah, basically, basically KBP. It was it was along those lines. Yeah, exactly, Jelly. Yeah, the first one was when was when Ducky won, and that was it was a different qualification process, and it was less teams and everything, so it was a better environment for Bretts. Now, obviously, it was you know not taking away anything from Ducky, but 
specifically regarding Brett's, it was a it was a better time for Brett's and Delves, yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Hey, uh, is he gonna wrestle or not? <laughs> I like how again he hasn't really, uh, <laughs> he hasn't really gone for ball protection. No, we don't know, Jolly Old. People, some people who have signed NDAs are kind of violating those NDAs by telling us that they're going to limit movement to 9 max. A uh, few people have said that, um, but move 9 is going to be the max movement to stop natural one-turners. That's all we know. Alright, could blitz and then block the ball, or block and then blitz the ball, so either way it's, it's the same odds, isn't it? Pitch break. All right. <laughs> Got the push. Choose. Si le joueur arrive à conserver son intégrité physique, il oh, pourra rejoindre la zone d'embut en sprintant. Mais j'ai bien dit si. Oh non, that frees him up. <laughs> Bloody fend. I mean, they are really, aren't they? They're a bit stupid. Natural one turners and claw bomb are two of the biggest problems, I would say. Could have gone somewhere else, maybe safer. Maybe he's there or something. Didn't think of freeing him up with Fens. There you go. Fens quite good if you don't think about it. <laughs> As much as I hate Yeoman as the name of a p positional, uh, hardly any Wolfpack, but you know, people people don't like. I like they're they're kind of an unfun mechanic, aren't they? For like just to play a whole game and then you lose because they've got a player. Um, so you know, yeah, I think it's fair. I think it makes sense. Yeah. But, you know, maybe it speaks to who's involved more than anything, you know, like if you people have got their own pet peeves, haven't they? So if somebody who's involved with it, their own pet peeve is getting one-turn touchdowns, then they're going to change it, right? If somebody really hated... If somebody really hated um, Blitzers, then they would probably change Blitzers, wouldn't they? You know, it's the same kind of thing. I would say... Yeah, but I mean that's like that's meant to happen, isn't it? I wouldn't be surprised, honestly. Uh, hello, VIP Moradan, by the way. Um, tossing requires a lot of dice, and it's kind of like the point of the team, isn't it? Whereas, just I wouldn't be surprised if they never even thought of scoring in one turn with movement ten and sprint show feet. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if that was never on their minds when they made the game. 
Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised at all because they just don't care, do they? They don't care about it. Yeah, that's true, Wolfpack, yeah. So it's like, so it's all fucking swinging around about at the end of the day. Yeah, yeah exactly, Moradam, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, it just is what it is, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> Tiddy Valing. Tiddy Valing was the best mechanic that's ever been in Blood Bowl. <laughs> Prove me wrong. <laughs> right, he's going to go there without thinking. And also, he's going to block with Mighty Blow without thinking. Yes. Again! <laughs> Armor 7, not now, but Mighty Blow. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely fucking nothing. <laughs> right, can I do a chain? I mean, not really. No, oh, it was before your time. Oh, fuck. <laughs> it was before your time, Kilmatronics. And uh, there was a mechanic whereby if you stacked up... Um, if you stacked up movement, so say, say this character was to... Say I could score, I could go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, GFI, GFI, and then foul this player. And you wouldn't have to roll the GFIs, and you couldn't get sent off. It was a fine blitz. Didn't matter, I could have gone out this way. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it didn't matter. Oh, I couldn't follow though, so it was the wrong blitz. But there's more chance of knocking down. Yeah, there was move, but I couldn't have followed. But I wouldn't have used all my movement. Yeah, look. One, two, three, four, five, six. Don't worry, Jelly, I'm not that bad. <laughs> I'm not that bad, man. One, two. But yeah, it was only like three squares to get there. And the fan wouldn't matter. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. What are you doing? What are you doing here? I was gonna have to dodge anyway if I was gonna uh. blitz this guy, I'd still have to dodge. Anyway. Because T D, because you could only do it on a T D. So T D fouling, and then that sounds T D T D sounds a bit like Tiddy. <laughs> 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 there you go, titty fouling. <laughs> yeah, you couldn't get sent off. Yeah, well, that's alright, isn't it, Julio? There's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. Hello, C Knuckles! VIP C Knuckles! The, the Orc Thrower himself! <laughs> Glorious. Um, not this time, Flicky Flack. Maybe in future, but yeah, this is the first one that I uh, haven't done. Um, I'm just going to do the... Uh, he doesn't at the moment. Just going to do the commentary this time. Stalling for the 1-0 loss. <laughs> You're the only Orc thrower so far. <laughs> Fucking <laughs> Orc Thrower. What a brilliant meme. What a brilliant meme, the Orc Thrower. I need to add uh, Griff Overwalt here, don't I? Or like, Gutter Runner. <laughs> Skitter Stab Stab. That'd be, I should have just made them all stars. Clever. Well, we've got a 3 plus dodge now at least. He does not have a scoring threat, no, unless he dodges with this uh, lineman. He's uh, stalling for the loss. Yep. <laughs> that is 
That right, is what he's doing. <laughs> well, well, you can get it, see knuckles, glorious. Um, right, do I just go for the score? I think so. Like I could go for a chain, with a more chance to fail, but better fail state. Clever Jim. Instantly failed. <laughs> so dodge there, then he goes one, two, three, four, five, six square, pals him, and then the ball carrier doesn't have to dodge, and at least it was an extra roll, but at least uh, failing it didn't give him the ball. I don't know if it was worth it or not. But double one, double six, double one. Not a lot was going to work with those dice. Uh, how's my caps lock finally broken? Said hello there, in all caps. Yeah. Hello there. Caps lock's working fine. <laughs> yeah, turn 16 dodging would have been better, yeah. Yeah, because the failure state, yeah, the failure state is still ball on the ground, doesn't matter. Whereas there, yeah, you might fail a knockdown. But I mean, it is an extra one in nine roll. Oh, it's a double power thing. <laughs> also, doing that means maybe a mighty blow hit, right? And more guards around the ball. If I failed the second one, like getting more guards around the ball was good, wasn't it? This was another guy. Kaz. Kaz from the block. <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs> Flint Blanc Blue. <laughs> oh, Backyard Dodo. VIP Backyard Dodo. Hello. No, I might get, I might get Apple, I might get cast on my own turn. It wasn't a perm, was it? Fucking. Fuck, fuck injuries that aren't perms. He could kill a guy now. Look, 1D pal. Kaz. Never underestimate the ability of my players to get injured, Kilmatronics. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. <sighs> yes, hopefully there'll be a beautiful pass coming on the last turn, yeah. Fingers crossed. Maybe no one's going to die in turn 16, but I could fail a dodge or a GFI or something. So, it's not definite that no one's died yet. GG. Right, do we just 1D him to then go there for the ball? How in, and then go four, five, six, lob it over his head because he's not got catch. So one D on the ball. One D, pal. Let's go. Not a pal. On appelle ça une passe de la dernière chance. Le coach a roll the two. Never lucky. Les bonnes renvoient le ballon 
sur le terrain. Ça va changer toute la dynamique du match. Never looking. <laughs> Instant two. <laughs> Let's forget the five plus. <laughs> Let's forget the five three three. And just say instant two. Uh, not much money. I thought I had more money than this. MVP. Oh man, Tuddy, Tuddy on Moridan will be. Uh, will be blue waffle. <laughs> Oh, hello, Ebi. I thought you might have been in chat, seeing as you, uh, you said something that sounded, sounded, oh god, I didn't realise that was three missed next game, that sounded somewhat defensive after I'd said something, and uh, I wasn't criticising. Ten, so yeah, I guess it doesn't, if I had uploaded this mess, the last missed next game, I could have gone to 12 players, but as it is, going to have to have a loaner for the next game. Yeah. I was a little bit... I was a little bit frustrating. Yeah, the, the app would have failed anyway, I'm sure. That was a little bit frustrating to not make more AV breaks, I'm not going to lie. Only made 10 AV breaks. Got AV... no. Yeah, 13. 57 blocks. For two cars. That's a little bit disappointing. What was my armor for? My armor was 40%. <laughs> armor of the Burts was 71, and loads of those were armor 7 with it against Mighty Blow. So I feel a little bit hard done by not leveling. Uh, not leveling. Change the record. I know, sorry, I shouldn't be complaining. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, maybe, Rick. Maybe. Right, that's the end of the YouTube video, not the stream. So, thank you to all my Patreons. As you can see, more now, including Pride of Place, the Orc, the Orc Thor himself, C Knuckles. <laughs> right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.